bit of this book that my, my, my next uh, guest wrote. It's, uh, it's from chapter 7, it's page 82. <laughs> <laughs> Here's the thing with flirting. The key is that you be open, open to being seduced. You are putting your best foot forward and looking for the best in your potential partner. So this is about making no commitments, but remaining positive and open to possibility. I made myself sick a little bit there too. <laughs> when you flirt, you deserve, you reserve the right to walk away at any time, but you're hoping to be surprised and delighted. And what's weird is, it's from a diet book. <laughs> what a surprise! <laughs> it's from uh, The Kind Diet. It's in stores now. Please welcome its author, the very lovely Alicia Silverstone, everybody. <laughs> Alicia Silverstone. I've known you for years. I can't believe you haven't been on this show before. It's very kind of you to finally show up. <laughs> no. You look very nice, though. Well, thank you. Yeah, that's lovely. I, I can't believe you've written a book. I know. It's a very grown up, a, a diet book. I you don't know. need to be on a diet. Well, the whole meaning of diet, it, I want to sort of reinvent the word. In the 1600s, people referred to a diet as a way of thinking or a day's journey rather than a, you know, yeah, but in the 1600s, they also tried to cure blindness by putting dog poop in people's <laughs> eyes. Well, that part maybe not. Well, good. let's not do that <laughs> let's again. Let's not do that. Let's right, not do that. Okay. But the nice part is that the word diet doesn't have to be like deprivation and horror and. All right, because you're you're a big old vegan, aren't you? Well, I am, but the whole thing about flirting. <laughs> I wasn't flirting, honest. I was just no, asking. No, but I'm about... just I'm just saying that you don't have to be vegan, so you can just... This book is for people who just want to feel their best or look their best and... Um, or want to save the planet, whatever. There's no bacon in this, is there? Well, there's tempeh bacon. Look at this tempeh bacon. Tempeh bacon? Yes. Bacon from Arizona? <laughs> I'll find you some tempeh bacon. Tempeh bacon, eh? Where bacon is it? from Arizona. I mean, well, let's just... I don't, you for? I don't know. I don't know. Alright, Thanksgiving. There's Thanksgiving. Look at that. Oh, that's, that looks that sausage. Looks yummy, What's that right? then? Pecan crusted Satan. <laughs> Satan, is that so Satan? Yeah. No way! <laughs> Get the heads up! I'm demon time! <laughs> you can't go eating stuff called Satan! Are you mad? <laughs> Um, well, this uh, so it's not all vegan stuff. It's lovely other stuff too. Not that vegan stuff isn't lovely. What of it course. is is a, a toolbox for you to um, take in all this information and hopefully help you have a healthier, happier life. That's really what it is. And the destination is not so important. The journey is what it is. So it's giving you great information that you can sort of dabble with and see and flirt if you'd like, or you can become a superhero. Flirt and use food. Yeah. <laughs> Hey, do you remember that time we went to Tim Spall's house in London for yes, dinner? Yes, I do. Oh, that was weird, wasn't it? <laughs> was that the time that um, we, Brenda and I were in the boat, and the boat, we, we all went over in the boat? The dog no, the, that, you yeah. and I wasn't there okay, with the boat. One. No, the time was, the, we've known each other for what, quite a long time. We a thought, long like, time. We, uh, and people were always trying to set us up before you were married. Yeah, at yeah. least I tried to set us up. <laughs> and you were like, no way, Grandpa. And I, I was like, oh. <laughs> I don't remember that. Yeah, part. all right. <laughs> anyway, yeah, oh boy, yeah. Well, my mind's cloudy with it as well. But the uh, we went to the the very good British actor Tim Spall. Yes. We went to his house. He's a fantastic actor, Tim so Spall. Lovely. You'd recognise him if you saw. He's been here. So lovely. He's been here on the show. He's been here on the yeah, show. He yeah. came here before you from well. London. <laughs> but he, um, <laughs> his kids, his kids went mad because they thought I'd eaten all the white meat of the chicken. Remember. <laughs> All the kids, because he's got like 50 or 60 children, and they. Or, or three. No, no, and they were all sitting around the dinner. It was all very Dickensian, and we turned up for Sunday dinner, and they were all like, hey, the Scottish bloke was eating all the white meat and the chicken. And I was like, I didn't. Alicia had some, and they went, see, he's a vegan. She doesn't eat me. You and I only had, I had like two pieces, and then I, I bumped into Tim Spall in New York years later, and he went, oh, the kids still talk about it. He said. <laughs> I'm surprised you don't remember that. I don't remember that part. I just slept over at their house recently. Did you really? Yeah. Is it still the same place in same South London? Same place. 
Did you? You didn't uh, eat. Don't eat in front of his kids. These kids go mad. <laughs> Grand grandkid now living there as well. Really, so, he's a grandpa so now. Yeah, it's so God. sweet. <laughs> <laughs> what a horrible thing. Yeah, it's a bit. <laughs> yeah, are you English? Are you you seem to know a lot of English people and and spend a lot of time there. Yeah, my parents are English, really? and I spent all my childhood going to England and going to camp in England. Really, what camp? What camp in England? Where? Um, camp Beaumont. That's a rehab. Is it? <laughs> Been. No, it's not. It's not. I don't know. Campbell I was the only American. Well, there was like one other American there, but it was always like. Was the other American there Liv Tyler? Because I think I remember. <laughs> I saw that. Really? Um, <laughs> ah, Perry Grandpa. Hey, kids! <laughs> I did a bunch of movies there, so I saw You did a do a lot of movies. And there. I remember. Um, I played a Scottish maid in a play, and I, I think that... Did you tell Mary that there was no way I could do a Scottish accent? Did that happen? Did I make Mary, that up? Mary who? Mary Steam version. No, I, may have, I, I may have made this up. No, no, Mary was here, and no, Mary said that you were did doing it? a Scottish accent in the play, and it was very good, and I said, well, I bet it is, I said. Oh, really? Did yes! You? <laughs> I, I remember distinctly. You've got to watch Steenbergen. She... <laughs> I just made this up. I'm no, just no, no you. I, did you do a Scottish accent? I did. How was it? Oh, Want to try it? Try, well, read a little bit of the book. Well, in Scot um, my favourite thing is when you should, this. Can I? Can I not do that? But yes. Yes. Instead, you can but, not I, do I, that. but instead, but I can tell you that this the little character I played. She always said she was saying like one time my Annie, Annie McPherson lost her locket. Actually, she lost it more than once. She used to tie her apron. She to, and then she would talk about the pie That's... and she said me pay, me pay. If she's talking about pie, or I like, understand, I understand. you understand? But me pie, me pie, <laughs> or, or I, the light, the the lie, the lay about a lie. Uh, about I, a lie, lie yes, a lie. Yes, I don't Scottish. <laughs> yeah, and I love. But that's her. really good. I don't know. That's it. Sounds like girls yeah. I grew up with. <laughs> she was from the. She was from the north. North, what north. part? North of Scotland, up in the Highlands, north, where yeah. everyone's. I can't remember where she was from, but it was like the north somewhere. Might, might have been the north of England. So. No, it's the north of Scotland. No, north of Scotland. Have you ever been up there to the no, north of Scotland? Up no. there, it's very beautiful up in the north of Scotland. They've got, it's like Oregon, but dry. Really? <laughs> I want to go. You should go. I you should. Like go. Next time you're with Tim Spall, if yeah. you want to avoid his kids, get up there, yeah. I drove all around Ireland. That was really fun. Really? Driving yeah. around Ireland? Yeah. Were you... Oh, okay. <laughs> Back to Camp Beaumont when you finished? <laughs> Listen, it's lovely to see you again, and uh, I'm very pleased that you've written this. But I'm actually going to do some of this. I'm going to eat some of this Satan. Will you just read yeah. it? Will you just read it? Like, not right now. Oh, that's nice. Look, yeah. show the piglet. It's asleep. <laughs> it's asleep. You could cut a little slice off it. We'd never know. Oh, it's a joke. It's a joke. I didn't mean it. It's okay. It's okay. I, it's, I'm sorry. It must be awful for you going out and people all eating meat in front of you. And no, it's fine. That's why I'm talking about flirting, because I really want people to know that it's not all or nothing. You can just take good steps to get there. All right, then. Well, we will. Oh! Uh oh Oh, it's getting close to Halloween. This is awesome! We've gone to radio, everybody! <laughs> it's radio, everybody, quietly. Keep going. Keep going. Keep, keep going what? Well, keep going? <laughs> we'll be right back, everybody! <laughs> There's a power outage in the whole building. Look, look. It took us nearly five years to get Alicia to come here, and then she comes here and the damn lights go out. <laughs>